It is Anissa and Fitri. This is on weekdays and I think everyone, even students, having a hectic day. So, I'm constantly to making to-do lists. There is to-do list for online studying at the Mersing Polytechnic in Malaysia today at 7 o'clock. Um, exactly at 8 a.m. Malaysia time. I took part in student exchange through the TV exchange program 2022. I can share it with friends from Malaysia and learn business with people who have some interest. Even though it is done online, learning takes place effectively because we practice it directly. I wish I could follow this program again and go there. Yep, go to Malaysia or other country. In the afternoon, I have a class at IPB University. I am majored in agribusiness management. Besides learning about business management, I also learn about agriculture. It's about crops, husbandry, and fishing. Although my campus is located in Bogor, I was born and grew up in the northern part of West Java, Karawang. This city has the highest area of rice farming compared to others. Because of that, it is dubbed the city of rice granaries. This made me familiar with the world of agriculture science childhood, and therefore I wanted to study at Bogor Agricultural University. There are many typical cultures of Karawang and West Java, one of which is Topeng Banjet Banjet mask is one of the traditional theater arts. The Banjet mask show consists of several stages, namely music, music and song performance, ronggeng dance with jokes and stories, Stories in the art of Banjet Mas are usually about romance, history, and legend. The appearance of the story is always accompanied by a various pencha silat movements. In a sense, this art contains moral message and has a heroic or heroic then. Apart from being a college student, I also like art for relaxation in between busy schedules. Besides that, I also like DIY and craft. Very pleasant. In my opinion, this can minimize stress. And I have a special account to share my work, that is Chocovin. I want it. I made it. I want it. I made it. I think that's enough for today. See you next time.